Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play the Feeble Files, where we play the Feeble Files, even though we know it's not good for us. Uh, last time, we got the urge to visit this asteroid with a tomb on it of our previously unmentioned grandfather. Um, and we're gonna, we're gonna give it a go and see. I've been thinking a lot about playing the Feeble Files and why I should continue. And um, I've come to the conclusion that I'm going to persevere for now, unless it gets horrendously worse. Because there's, there's still a, a thread of something interesting there in having a look at the story it's trying to tell, how it designs its puzzles poorly, and how they, the two affect each other. So, for example, this granddad tomb that we've been introduced to all of a sudden, um, having gone to elaborate lengths to break into our former workplace, only seemingly to read uh, the video phone messages from our mother. So all that stuff that doesn't really make any logical sense if you're looking to solve your immediate problem, which is transportation, um, it all colours our view of Feeble and what he's trying to do um, and that's that's kind of an interesting thread to follow along um, alongside everything else so let's see what happens next it's a new location so there's always hope Okay, uh, there's a camera, a drawer, a coffin, can't quite make out what the, the text is on that, there's teeth in a jar, which I don't think I can interact with, so that might just be a comedy prop. Oh, hello, I just walked forward and it's all <gasps> kicking off. Oh. What's happening? Boy, what did you think? I was a ghost or something? I was, um, I was just, uh, that is, I... Oh, look, it's been a bad day, okay? Did you bring some flowers? No, I didn't realise I was supposed to. Well, that is, I didn't really expect you... Didn't realise you were supposed to? <laughs> I'm dead, aren't I? In a manner of speaking, I guess. I don't recall seeing you at the funeral. You were in a coffin. I had it taped. It's amazing what you can do these cycles. Look, I... Um... I expect you're wondering just why you're here. It's funny you should mention it. It's to do with your inheritance. Inheritance? I didn't know I had an inheritance. You don't until you prove yourself worthy. What? What does prove yourself worthy mean? I forgot something. You can have part of it. Senile old... <laughs> Rude. People's definitely got issues. So, what did any of that mean? Where did it come from? Um... Where's it going? So there's still a... So that's like the projector. Oh, is this, what's this symbol on the floor? A faded symbol on the floor. Mm, yeah. What I can make out is the slight circle outside of it. Let's look at this drawer. It's a metal strong box. All right, can we do anything with that? Ooh, apparently we can. We got something that we didn't... Oh, paper. It's a huge blank piece of paper. Right. 
every freedom fighter should have some in case a sudden slogan springs to mind. Okay, so we can do some graffiti. Is that how we prove ourselves? My grandfather's body is in there. Oh. So that was a, a living will situation, was it? We can't do anything with the teeth, that's just a gag. Um, can I do anything with the symbol? I can't do anything with it. So I've got this giant piece of paper. It's a huge blank piece of paper. Can I do like a rubbing of the symbol? But have I got anything um, that I can make marks with? I don't think I do. So this is just, uh, I don't think this plays into the theme of enlightening people's character very much. It's just the game blatantly throwing another element at you that doesn't seem to have any direct relevance to anything else that's going on. So that's fun. Um, what, what else were we supposed to be doing? I've forgotten now. There's a cool car there that I need to get away from the the magnet of the jump ship. And there's hmm I'm not sure. Know that there's a place I've seen graffiti before, so let's try there. Can we combine our spray paint with a symbol? Does that work? No, if he was still doing his I can't balance up there thing. I can't reach it. Uh, maybe Dell will want to know about our holographic grandfather. Sam? I can tell you this or not. This cold spell won't be doing my bunions no good at all. I mean, the actor playing Sam must be having a great time. Greetings, comrade. What is it, Feeble? No, nothing. I was just wondering, that's all. Have you got the ship sorted out? I'm working on it. Well, what are you doing here then? All right, all right. There's no need to be like that. I'm going. Frankly, I've been, the game's given me a lot of mixed signals. So I wonder if I'm actually supposed to use the spray paint in Attention the all tomb. Is no so if I can't use the spray paint, maybe I can use the paper in some way here. Let's try it. I'm not quite sure how it would work, but it's worth a try. Wobble, wobble, wobble. No. So I wonder if we've got to spray a symbol on Good the cycle, floor in citizens. the tomb. Let's do it. Let's try and paint on the floor. I could do it if I had a design to work from. Okay, how do we get our design? Um, hmm. I'm on the right track, apparently, but I hadn't quite made the lateral leap that the boxes are not high enough by themselves so we need something else to go on there uh, 
like several stacks of adverts. I think I'd almost have preferred if um, there was a, I don't know, some kind of more intuitive solution. Maybe as part of Feeble's outfit, if he was wearing heels, um, then the, the outfit would have, you know, like a practical element to solving the puzzles as well. Right, let's try and do the paint on this symbol. Is that helpful? He could have got on the bin lid anyway, why didn't he? Oh, feeble. You. Right. Oh. Right, now it's. I can't quite make it out, but it looks like the symbol of the freedom fighters. Alright, you just seem to spray it black with your red spray can. And then. Can I do something with the paper? Oh, I hate this animation. He could have got up to the ladder and the bin lid. Or went, why is there a ladder there? If we're not going to use it. Can I use the ladder? Oh, man. Right, back to the tomb. Thinking about it. An inventory-based adventure game such as this is, is really training the player to uh, expect a use for everything. So it's kind of like a, something like Chekhov's gun in the adventure game terms, in that if you see something, you expect you're going to have to use it. And that's a mindset that can work against the game and has has done several times in um, the feeble files for sure okay I think feeble's ready to, to spray paint wow I think you probably wouldn't need a stencil for that to get that level of accuracy but the two onion skills for you. Well done, boy. Well done. You were in the Freedom Fighters once? Certainly was. Led it. For a time, anyway. This is incredible. Look here, Feedle. It's, um, Feeble. Would you kindly not interrupt me, please? Now, where was I? Look here, Feedle. Oh, yes. Look here, Feedle. Why are you here? I came to, uh, see you. No, no, no! Why are you here at all? Uh, I don't know. I've never really thought about it. Would you like to know exactly why you are here? <laughs> why? You are here because of fate. It was written <coughs> that you should come here. Written? Where? Where written things are written. Don't ask stupid questions, boy. Why are you flickering? Flickering? What are you talking about? <coughs> uh, where was I? It was written. Oh, yes. I remember it like it was only last cycle. Uh, something about you coming here, and I was supposed to give you something. And a name? Feedle, or something. Are you all right? I think the power must be going on this thing. What was it that was written? I can't tell you that. What I can say is that you'll do something good. Or was it something bad? I think it was something, something bad. bad will happen to you. I don't quite remember. <laughs> anyway, I've got something for you. <laughs> Looks like a screwdriver. A 
key pass card and a sonic screwdriver. What? You a Doctor Who reference. Oh, you'll have to excuse me. I'm afraid my oral circuits have just shut down. We don't have much time. When I was alive, I discovered an ancient secret. It will give you the power to destroy the company and create a happy and free life for citizens everywhere. The details... <coughs> the details are on that piece of paper I've just given you. Paper? What paper? Are you talking when I am again? <laughs> be quiet and listen. It won't be easy, but if you follow the instructions, on there to the letter. You can accomplish anything. There's no paper in here. Just a key and a screwdriver. I expect you're wondering why I didn't... <coughs> why I didn't tell you this sooner. <laughs> but you see, I knew that either you or your brother would join the Freedom Fighters, but I didn't know which one. Stop! Listen! Read my lips! There's no paper in here! You should think yourself very lucky, young Fiedel. <laughs> to you, I present the means to bring peace and joy to the universe. And all your brother will get is a junk ship K-Pass and an old sonic screwdriver. <laughs> <laughs> Why does nothing ever go right for me? Okay, well that was a lot. So we had sort of the chosen one, but maybe our brother got the secret to uh, changing the universal order. And we got the junk prize, which isn't really any surprise to me. And I think that, with all its cutsceneiness, is enough for one episode. So. See you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.